There's a lot of things I hate in life, but one of them is a godforsaken boss, and his name is, well, I can't remember, so for now, da 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 I'm a ducky, I'm a pink duck, yeah, babe, I know you can't even see it, anyways, seven times, seven godforsaken times I've died to this boss. And you guys probably know what boss I'm talking about if you have ever played this game. It is the infamous and annoying ass Pokemon Hater. Fudging, I can't remember his name. Fudge. Shoot. I seriously can't remember his name. Why do I keep on going that way? I don't like battling trainers, by the way. I feel it's a waste of time and money. And also, I feel it's what you're supposed to do, and I don't like doing what you're supposed to do. So, yeah, that's another reason why. Um, anyways, just gonna go in here, gonna go in here. And you see, this is the boss. Anyone that's ever played this game knows what boss I'm talking about. If you have seen this route. Although, for a lot of people, it might be easy. Yeah, repel. For a lot of people, it might be easy. But you know what? I played X first. I played Pokemon X first. You know how goddamn easy that game was? That was the easiest game I've ever played. Well, it's Pokemon, it's supposed to be easy. But that EXP share, though. That EXP share and X and Y just last load and blew me away. Like, you can... It was my first Pokemon game, so technically it didn't. I thought every Pokemon EXP share did that. God, I've never been more wrong in my life. Well, other than that one time I got an F on my test. But that doesn't count. <laughs> Actually, it's exactly the reason, but still. Now, I hate going through this entire ship just to get out of it. <laughs> but, anyways, you guys probably already know who I'm talking about. Let me just go find him. Let me go find the dick of all trades. You'll probably hear a lot of swearing in this video, because I'm going to try and fight him. Last time took me almost, uh, 20 minutes. Uh, just because I have sucky Pokemon. Because I beat the Elite Four with smaller levels than this group. Uh, level 59. I can... Okay, I beat the Elite Four and Champion with a smaller group than this on X and Y. Like, all of them were level 40. Straight level 40. I have a level 59 Samurai. 52 Saucebuck. 49 Mag Magnezone. 46 Altaria. 45 Virizion and 43 Umbreon, which is super happy with me. I've been training him all, all the time. Now, that's the team. I beat the Godforsaken Elite Four and Champion with just straight 40s across the board in X and Y. Then this, then I'm like, okay, you know what? That, that game was so easy. I, I guess all Pokemon games are like, this is just supposed to be a fun. It's just supposed to be a fun little game for everyone to play. I've never been more wrong in my life. Pokemon X was just supposed to get you in introduced, because most kids nowadays have like a stinging 3DS, not like a stinging Game Boy or something. Because <laughs> no one has DS. Um, anyways. <laughs> I hit life. Uh, yeah, here we have uh, this guy. Yeah. Y'all know who I'm talking about. Gets this. God forsaken gets this. Anyways, <clears throat> I'll take down this disgusting trainer with my own hand. This time I will succeed. You su you succeeded in those seven times now. No matter what they try, no one will be able to stop me. I love the music for this one. Gets this. Team Plasma. Team Plasma dickhead! He has more... He has more Pokemon than the Elite Four. Well, Elite Four and F and X and Y. Like I said, I'm not com I am comparing them. I mean, this is my first one. I have never done this. Now, you see, I Aqua Tail because I always Aqua Tail for this guy. I've Aqua Tailed the two times and I just knocked him right out. Out cold. But he poisons me. So, you see, this is what I'm like. I'm like, you know what? Oh. Fine, protect yourself. Oh, what's that? He protected himself. Oh, no, no. Oh, fuck. Um, I'll go to it again, just because I can. Oh, this time I go first for some stupid-ass reason. 
I get down about half his health. Love that. And he changes my goddamn thing, which I actually had a really good ability. He's gonna hit me with that. I'm on the brink of swearing. Oh, what's that? He uses stinking leftovers. Yay. Everyone loves leftovers, right? I'm getting hurt by the poison. He was expecting that type of move, even though I did nothing. Aqua Tail again. And this is where I start to get ticked off. Oh yeah, Kafakrikus down! That's actually the first time I ever knocked him down with this guy. A lot. What was that? Everyone else saw that just randomly drop, right? Every from, everyone saw my HP drop from stinking 50 something to that. And I'm gonna Razor Shell, because I always use Razor Shell on this guy. Half the time it just knocks him out cold. Yeah, see? Half damage. Yeah, that's awesome, right guys? Ah, uh, yeah, acrobatics. Yay, Samurai's dead. And Samurai's mummy. So that makes Electrus's ability become mummy. Which I hate. I hate how I'll just keep on transferring. That's the only problem. Now, I usually go to my second strongest, but you know, it's Electros. So why don't I just go for freaking Magnezone, right, guys? Might as well go for a Magnezone. Believe you can kill him. He's, it's electric versus electric. It should be fair game. Nothing should absolutely fa make me fail. So, I flash hand this guy, uh, yeah. Not very effective. So I'm like, oh, whatever. He has flamethrower. He has some flamethrower. This is the first time that hasn't burned me. And I'm gonna electric ball, oh, happy days, happy days. And I'm like, oh yeah, he's dead! He's dead, how are you la? He's dead! Yeah, he did! Seismitoad. Doi. Seismitoad is weak to what? Well, he's water. Electricity, duh. Seismitoad's water and poison, isn't he? I hope. Yeah, damn it. What was poison immune to? Oh, god damn it, electricity, what do you know? So I'm like, oh no, Seismitoad, which sounds a lot like Sesame Street. No. Uh, so I'm like, I have a softbox and an Altaria. Well, and these two guys, which are useless. Especially Umbreon. So I'm like, you know what? I'm saving this guy for his Hydreigon. So Sawsbuck, how about you go out there and have some fun? And Sawsbuck, every single time I've done this, I got poisoned and just got raped. Yes, you heard me. He just wrecked me. So I'm like, jump kick to the rescue. He does about a third of his damage. So I'm like, you know, I'll just do two more of those. Right, guys? Right? Uh, yeah, he hits me with that. He was gone. Scout poison was super effective against that. So I'm like, god damn it. I got these three. So I'm like, you know what? Umbreon, sacrifice. You're in charge, Umbreon. And I always sacrifice the weakest if three of my Pokemon are down. It's just a thing I do. And also, I have last resort, so I'm going to do COVID bite and what's the face? COVID bite and quick attack. I usually go in that order also. So I'm like, COVID, yeah. And he didn't give me his item. Last time, stinking Hydreigon gave me a stinking life orb. It wrecked me. That's why I died. I'm going to bite him. And I don't use items for multiple reasons. I don't have any. So I'm like, quick attack, please. And the and quick that goes in and he has quick down so I'm like god damn it Umbreon's dead I have two guys left and one of them I need to fight Hydrogen with Brizion it's your turn and this has been my strategy each and every time it's actually going a bit better last time I didn't even I didn't get to see him before now I'm gonna Giga Drain him because I can and it's super effective apparently I'm dumb also, and I don't know the. I was about to talk stroke, which annoys me. I've never seen talk stroke yet. Oh my god, he looks like the ninja of the stinking Unova region. I'm gonna Giga Drain him. Mainly because I just like having lots of health. Oh god damn it. I thought it was effective again. Seeing my hate now? You guys seeing my hate? Are you guys seeing why I hate this game? So I'm like, out there you go, you're my last resort, you're gonna get me screwed over, I know it. Uh, anyways, uh, yeah, Dragon Bros just waste my dragon moves, he's gonna suck a bunch of me. I'm like, uh, you know what, not too much damage. Dragon Bros, nothing. 
So I'm like, you know what, just fly and get away from there. And he wasn't that me, and I'm like, yeah, screw you. So I fly by, and I'm like, you know what, screw you, dude. And he poison tries to poison jab me again. I fly, jab him in the face, and apparently it's super effective, which I didn't know. So I'm like, you know what, I'll do that again. Full score. And I'm like, oh, god damn it. And I'm like, yeah, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. And then out there is just gonna be a jerkwad. I'm recording a video. And I'm like, oh yay, out there is dead. And that is why I hate thinking get sick. You guys see my hate me? You guys see? Because for when Kurt nearly killed me last time you were in a video, and also, no. Shut up. And that toxic joke. It's the bane of my existence. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys hate Toxic Rogue as much as I do. Thank you. And Chris blacked out. Bye. Plunk.